Hi, welcome to Mandatory Update uh, clip episode. Extravaganza. Extravaganza, as we're, you would say. Yes. Uh, we're we're uh, moving offices, and we have no idea if we're going to be able to shoot anything, so we made this episode. Uh, also, Elise is in Canada for some reason, uh, as, as you do. Yes, I'm known to go to Canada. Yeah. Uh-huh. So we thought we'd make a clip show of a best of of our worst episodes, one, one through ten. One through ten. One through That's ten. right. The oldies, but the not the, the kind of goodies. The not so goodies. The, the <laughs> maybe they'll get better with time. Yeah. <laughs> um, <laughs> anyway, we hope you enjoy it, and we'll see you next week from our new flashy new Woo! studio, and it's gonna blow your socks off. So stay tuned for more mandatory updates. Blow your we have mind! Let's tell them to enjoy the clip show. Enjoy the clip show! <laughs> Welcome to Mandatory Update, the show where talentless game journalists make petty little jokes. Where I only have two shirts and she can't talk. I mean, Hank. And I'm Elise Williams. I'm Elise Williams. Mm. Welcome to Mandatory Update, a veritable menagerie of undesirables with news tangentially related to video games. I am Ian Hink. And I am undesirable. <laughs> a new website can now tell you how much time you've wasted on League of Legends. The answer is all of it. Why Microsoft is lowering the price of their system is unknown, but it has been speculated that Microsoft has changed their strategy and now want people to buy the Xbox One rather than just make fun of it. The wait is almost over. Hotline Miami 2 wrong number has been given an approximate release date of Q3 2014. Until then, there's a playable demo out right now. Ah! Elise, no! ah! A recent study showed that playing violent video games tends to leave teens morally immature and lacking in empathy and concern for the well-being of others. Personally, I can't help but agree. It almost makes me want to stop hanging out at the middle school all the time. Almost. Ian, I have told you, a hundred feet away at all times is not a recommendation. It's a court order. I know, but you can't you can't make out the thigh muscles at a hundred yards. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! That's standard. That's standard. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Call of Duty Elite shut down this week. Launched with Modern Warfare 3, the service kept track of players' stats and connected them with each other. Millions have been left wondering who fucked their mom last night. Bangable? Yeah, bangable. Uh, like, you want to bang him. This is why we added a scarf. It makes him much more attractive. It's also why we made him taller. Now you can maybe imagine Sonic in your bed. Maybe you could imagine taking this thing to the movies. And then banging afterward. Thank you, Ian. I am here in Iceland. What's VR? This! This is VR! Soon, everybody will be wearing one of these. I went to the food court. The, the food court, there are bodies stacked like cordwood. There are people fighting with rocks. Orgy, violence. Now, some people really hate on World of Warcraft. They say it's addictive, it's like crack. Well, let me tell you something. Crack is addictive because it's so good. Horrible, disgusting, transcendent, magnificent orgy. It was sublime. Pokebank is more than just an online storage system. It's immortality. Here's evidence a medieval scroll licensing gummy bears to German monks, an ancient papyrus fragment licensing caramel as a cure for gout, and this, a clay tablet, a contract with bees licensing sugar for honey. Sugar? I'm sorry, Ian, you can't use that word without the proper license. Check this out, check this out. See, this is my new wife. Isn't she hot? And, and watch this. This is my girlfriend. They get along great. And now I must go to complete my last two things on my bucket list before I die. I want to see the Grand Canyon, and I want to eat a bowl of ice cream. You've never had a bowl of ice cream? Great. Thanks, Rob. Rob Slusser. What the fuck? I, I guess we can still do the 100th episode well, celebration. Yeah, we have a big thing planned for the end, so let's good. do it. Yeah, all right. Let's all right. do it. Release the balloons! They're not even inflated, Rob. God damn it. God damn it. <sighs> End of report. Great. You're stuck on a light. Oh, uh, well, thanks, Rob. Rob Slusser. Uh, when you look at the old Sonic from Japan, you might think, ew, Japan, you want to bang that? Leave that poor creature alone. He's so short. 
Funcom, makers of MMO The Secret World, were raided by Norway's Economic Crime Unit and the company's stocks have been closed during the investigation. Reporters at the scene said the lead investigator for the Norway ECU walked out of the Funcom offices into the chilled Norwegian tundra and said, It looks like Funcom stock isn't the only thing that's frozen. Yeah! There was Titanfall. Dark Souls 2. There was Tower. Dark Souls 2. I guess only Dark Souls 2 came out last Dark week. Dark Souls 2 came out last week. Towerfall Ascension, the four player battle driven successor to the original, will hit the PlayStation 4 on March 11th. I know what we'll be playing on March 11th Dark Titanfall. Souls 2. <gasps> what wouldn't Ice T like about a dungeon or a motherfucking dragon? The community quickly pointed out that the rare motherfucking is actually a wyvern and not a full dragon. You gotta know the struggle to direct that shit, my man. You gotta know the struggle. Nope. Oh. Mm -mm. Gamers in Italy are getting something a little extra with their pre-order of infamous Second Son in the form of a can of Red Bull and glow-in-the-dark condoms. As a North American, I should feel slighted, but I don't need some game promotion to tell me to bottom out on energy drinks and masturbate in the dark. This is America, goddammit. America. The first of Microsoft's self-published titles from their ID at Xbox program have been revealed. Nut Jitsu, a free game for Windows Phone where you play as a sneaky squirrel, and Worms Battlegrounds, a battleground with worms. If you get the urge to play with nuts and worms and don't own an Xbox One, you can just load up the web-based indie game Lo-Fi Dick Fight. Thank you for that shockingly sad insight into your life. <laughs> oh, all the pieces are coming together. When pressed for further comment, she went on to say, You know, the one where a woman can be judged by her skill and knowledge and not by her appearance. Oh wait, that time doesn't exist yet. Now get away from me, you jackals, and let me make the game. As she walked away, we all had to agree that she's still one of the hottest women in gaming. You got no struggle, my man. You got no struggle. <laughs> well, Nax up the big one in North America, and now it's also the lowest scoring PlayStation 4 launch title reviewed by a popular Japanese gaming magazine that will go unnamed. When asked for a comment, former Sony mascot Crash Bandicoot said, Good, fuck that guy. And he threw his iced tea can. That guy's got a real green tea problem. Yeah. The daughter of a mobster is suing the makers of GTA V for supposedly using her life story for a minor character in the game. Meanwhile, a version of myself has come back from the future to sue me for using my life story in the months upcoming between May and September of 2015. I've hired past me as a lawyer since he's got some experience with this kind of thing. Mainly what I've learned from this whole experience is that it's all the same in the dark. Ah, uh, T-Rex and Titan San Francisco! Bus. Personally, I think Face Punch Studios... Face Punch Studios! Face Punch Studios! Face Punch Studios is... Face Punch Studios! <laughs> Face Punch Studios is overreacting just a little bit... Uh, but, sorry. Face Punch Studios! <laughs> Epic Games CEO Tim Sweeney says the reason they sold Gears of War to Microsoft was that they had no intention to develop the franchise for the foreseeable decade, and it was just sitting unused on the shelf by Epic. What would be replacing Gears on the shelf is unknown, but Infinity Blade looks real nervous. <laughs> It's you, are you blade. fucking it's melting my words? <laughs> it was perfect. Oh, stop. No air horn. Someone created a ver. Someone created a version. <laughs> stop. Let's do it. <laughs> That's good. We're using it. A 32 year old man was arrested for stealing a child's limited edition Pokemon 3DS in addition to five games, which he then resold to a used game shop. In other news, the office was able to scrape together bail, and here I am doing the news. Made a cool 60 bucks. <laughs> a recent study shows that children who play more video games than their peers show an increase in aggressive thoughts and behavior. However, the study coincides with a previous study that found that aggression subsides with age. Therefore, the effects of video game violence is short term. Yeah, I mean, I played a lot of games when I was a kid, and now that I'm closing in on 30, I feel fucking fine. Yeah. I, I just wish my fucking bagel didn't suck such total fucking ass this morning. Yeah, bagels will get you like Fuck! that. A new study shows that the brains of adolescents who spend more time playing games display greater cortical thickness in the frontal lobes. The study also found that adolescents who view online porn have thickness somewhere else, if you know what I mean. Am I right? <laughs> I'm right up top. Yeah. We remind you that this joke about underage erections comes from our legal guide. Yes. What a class act. Yeah. <laughs> an Austin-based theater company is turning an indie game into a stage play. Thomas Was Alone throws you into a world of squares and rectangles that have suddenly gained consciousness and must find a way through the game. 
there are already rumblings of drama on the set. Apparently, Square slept with Triangle's boyfriend, and now it's a whole big thing. Shapes. Can't live with them, and they cut the shit out of your d if you try to f them. The Last of Us will be hitting the PS4 in a remastered edition. To ensure they give fans more of what they loved about The Last of Us, the areas in the game have been made more linear, the AI has been dumbed down even further, several parts of the game that used to be playable are now cutscenes, and they've added a new feature where if you set the controller down for 15 seconds, the game just plays itself. Look, I hate The Last of Us as much as the next guy, but there's no need to beat a dead horse here. Let's just let the sales figures and lack of recognition speak for themselves. Deal. Deal. Rumors are flying about Dishonored 2 after a leaked logo popped up online. It's a funny irony that someone managed to take a secret photo in an nda meeting of a game all about stealth. You flew too close to the sun, Bethesda, and you burnt. You burnt. <laughs> we got to say it again. Yeah. Rah. The story about Atari dumping unsold E.T. cartridges in a New Mexico landfill is the stuff of video game legend. But now a documentary by Xbox Entertainment Studios is looking to dig up the landfill in search of the mythical cartridges. We were putting together a joke for this, but we didn't have the budget to get past the storyboarding phase, so here we go. All right, first thing, we burn Microsoft to the classic burn. Microsoft uh, is burned, so we go to the you, you burn. You burn. You burn, yeah. Uh, they're all burned. E.T. shows up, heals Microsoft with his magic finger, Microsoft. and that rolls in. Mm -hmm. And then that rolls into me comparing Elise's vagina to toxic garbage. End of joke, hold for laughter. Phoenix Interactive believes that the production of their game, Bible Chronicles, The Call of Abraham, has faced problems because Satan is deliberately trying to prevent the game from being released. To dig deeper into this story, we've arranged to speak with Satan himself. Uh, so did you delay the game, or...? Much in the same way LA is facing a massive drought, Los Santos is facing a creative one. You burnt! You burnt! Like the beautiful hillsides of the Santa Monica Mountains. They're made of dirt, mostly. But man, does that dirt burn. Mm -hmm. Players can actually get married in the Elder Scrolls Online. If you use the Pledge of Mara at the right shrine to Mara, you and your digital significant other will receive rings that bind you together in love for eternity. Nice. I'm totally gonna do this. Just nobody tell my wife in World of Warcraft. Or my wife in EverQuest. Or my wife in Ultima Online. Or my wife in Myst Online. Or my husband in Guild Wars. Or my kids. What game do you have kids in? Huh? Call of Duty has another novelty DLC pack coming out. The Devastation DLC gives players the opportunity to hunt with and be hunted by the deadly dreadlocked Predator. My only question is, why didn't they use the regular army? What do they need us for? Cause some damn fool accused you of being the best. Willems, you son of a bitch. What's the matter? CIA got you pushing too many pencils? Ha! Ha! Alright, alright. All right. The most recent Nintendo Direct announced the inclusion of Charizard and Gr Gren Greninja? Alright. Into the Super Smash Bros. lineup. Greninja, as known to fans, wears his tongue as a scarf. What? How does he eat? Doesn't it get dry? These Pokemons, Kyle. These Pokemons. They don't make any sense. He left us! He left us! But that's not what I'm going to do. It's just not the same. <laughs> I can't! Next joke. That's awesome. Well, that's it for Mandatory Update. I'm Elise Willems. And I'm Elise Willems, too. The, the sequel. sequel. Ah! Ah! Thanks for watching. Good night and good game. That one was so that cute. That was cute. <laughs>